Welcome to Apple Insider, everybody. It is Andrew here with one of, if not the best, wireless charger for your iPhone 10, iPhone 8, or iPhone 8 Plus. And as an exclusive for Apple Insider viewers, we have special discount codes, which I'll tell you more about at the end of the video. RAV Power introduced an entirely new lineup. So not only do they have their original fast charging wireless puck, they also have a new Hyper Air series which has a new charging pad, very similar to the charging puck. I'll touch on this in a minute. They also have a charging stand, which is really useful, especially if you have something like the iPhone 10, where you could definitely use that kind of propped up display a little bit more when it comes to unlocking your phone. And then lastly, aside from those ones, we actually have a portable solution, which is their wireless charging bank. So we're gonna dive through all of these and see if they still hold up and see if RAV power still is the king of wireless chargers for iOS users. Now, all of these chargers come with two different things. The first is the actual wall adapter. That is very important because a lot of ones out there don't actually include the wall adapter. You're kind of forced to find your own, but that is very important because these are charging fast. They need a quicker power adapter. So these come with a quick charge, 24 watt power adapter and a braided nylon micro USB cable. Now, while all of the actual chargers include both of these, the battery pack does not include the wall charger. It includes the USB cable, but you are going to need to provide your own wall charger. The first charger that we're going to look at is the original one, and the one that has long held the title of the best wireless charger for iPhones. And that is just this puck here, and it does support that 7.5 watts, and it was one of only three that supported it launch alongside Mophie and Belkin has a super nice feel to it. It's pretty much made out of metal with a little bit of plastic around the top and that silicone ring. It actually charges faster in real life, faster than both the Belkin and the Mophie. Even though they all support 7.5 watts, this does charge roughly about 20% faster in some of our testing. On the back, there is a micro USB port and there's a little status light right around the front. So there is one to compare it against from RAV Power, which is their new Hyper Air series. Now this is very similar. It does exactly the same thing, still charges at 7.5 watts of power, but unfortunately, it's a whole lot cheaper feeling. It is all made out of plastic. There's all these vents along the bottom, and it's roughly the same size other than just it's a more of a rounded square other than a circle, but there's just a huge difference in quality between the two. And funny thing is, prices are pretty much the same. We've been kind of scratching our heads of why RAV Power needs this other one in the lineup. If you have a choice between the two, clearly go for the more premium option. With our discount code, it's maybe only a dollar or two more, and there's a huge difference in actual quality in the chargers themselves, even if they charge at pretty much the same speed. So now we have the basic charging pads out of the way. Moving on, we have a charging stand, which can be really helpful if you've got an iPhone 10. It has a little silicone foot right there on the bottom compared to the anchor ones that we looked at that completely neglected that and made it easy for your phone to kind of slide out the side. It also has a pretty nice design. There's a lot of cooling going on in the back. Because with wireless chargers, if it starts to get warm, it'll slow down the charging so that it doesn't get too hot. So keeping everything cool is very important to really fast wireless charging. And you can definitely see that in this kind of neat design that they've put together that really benefits the cooling capabilities. Now, whenever you place your iPhone on there, instead of having to like lean over your desk to use Face ID, you can really easily unlock it directly when it's just propped up like this. It also makes it easy to have something ongoing, like a feed of some sort, or putting it horizontally as like a night clock or for watching a movie. Internally, there are two separate wireless coils, which are there for a few different reasons. One, it makes it possible to do things like have your phone vertically or horizontally, also makes it just work with a wider variety of devices. All of these chargers not only support that 7.5 watts on iPhones, but 10 watts on different Android devices. And sometimes they're just different heights, so having a couple different wireless chargers makes it just work with more devices. The last one we have to look at here is a portable solution, the Hyper Air Power Bank. This is a really neat solution for being able to use wireless charging on the go. It has a plastic body with a little silicone circle right on top where it has the Hyper Air word mark stamped in. That also just tells you where to place your phone as well as keeping it from somewhat sliding off the top. Along the front there, you can see there is a four different status LEDs letting you know how much battery power actually remains in this 10,400 billion power battery. On the end, you have a USB port so you can still charge traditionally as well as a micro USB input and a power button. Thing is, this does feel a little bit on the cheap end. It kind of is hollow feeling, which RAV power says is just to, again, accommodate some more of that cooling. But 
Portable batteries are just an odd place for wireless charging. They're handy in some situations like a restaurant, but other times they're awkward, like if you're walking around or if you want to throw it in your backpack. Using a cord in those situations is definitely more likely. Still, it's an enticing option and means you don't have to worry about any cables when you're on the go. So if there are situations where this is going to come in handy, this is definitely one of the better wireless charging batteries that we've seen. The new Hyper Air chargers are all very nice. They're all very fast, well made, and with our discount code that you can find below in the description, surprisingly cheap. But even months later, the original charging puck is still the best wireless charger that we've seen for iPhone 10, iPhone 8, and 8 Plus. Simply charges the fastest with a small footprint and definitely a premium build. If you want to pick one up with our discount code, making one of the lowest prices possible for this, you can find the links below in the description and let me know what you think in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, like it and hit that subscribe button. Also, check out our price guide, which makes it extremely easy to find the best deals on Apple products updated daily. Be sure to follow us on social media, and we'll see you in the next video.